We're gonna move on now to another trailer, because we're done with Hotel Transylvania for now, and instead we have... Ba -ba -ba -ba. You remember these guys? Have you heard about this? Do you know what this is all about? This is a thing I've been talking about earlier on. We mentioned it back in December on the main channel. Monsters, Inc. is getting a TV series. Uh, actually, we kind of mentioned it. It was on the side after talking about the cancelled Monsters, Inc. sequel that wasn't Monsters University. They're making another one. And uh, I want to see how it do. I enjoy the Marvel TV series. Let's see how the Pixar TV series end up. Let's watch a little bit of the sneak peek of Monsters at Work. They're putting you two in charge. You know what I like first off, right off the bat? The fact that there's just Pixar music. Original music? I, I, I know, we, like, it's because we've just come off Hotel Transylvania 4. Having, like, generic mainstream music bores me, because it's not my type of thing. But, like, just listen to that. What is that? That's not a saxophone. Trumpet? Whatever it is, whatever brass instrument it is, just... Oh, perfect. And iconic uh, Maybe I'm just really, really just going for that nostalgia bait, but they're putting you two in charge. He's like, ah, oh. <laughs> goes right for my, goes right for my nostalgia string. Which actually I didn't, I thought they weren't involved in this at all. I was under the impression that it was just going to be side characters doing their own new thing. I like this. All right. Immediately. Zipped on. And also, like, Mike looks good. He's got, like, a weird plasticine material on him, but I'm I'm enjoying this so far. <laughs> Two seconds in. Just kidding. It's laughter we're after. You're no longer hiring It's laughter we're after. Scarers are out. Jokesters are in. Report to Mift. What ex Yeah, of course. Were you not here, like, eight, uh, 17 years ago? 17 years ago? 17 years ago. Monsters, Inc. came out 17 years ago? 2004? I'm old! Anyway, if you're spoilers from a film from 17 years ago... Yeah, laughter's better than scrying. So what, this screamer is not good with the laughter job. Interesting. Longer hiring scarers? Scarers are out! Jokesters are in! Report to Mift! What exact... Guys, mm -mm. get a fame. One more thing. Uh... Did you know accidental safety is preventable? And something, it isn't what you do, it's what to you myth. think. What exactly is uh, uh. We're gearing up to make you smile. The new Monsters, Inc. The Laugh Energy. Pioneer. Okay. Uh, now you've done it. The Monsters, Inc. facilities team. If a machine needs maintenance, we maintain it now. Yeah. Okay, so it's about the maintenance team, and accidents are allowed to happen now. Accidents at work are what they're after, and no insurance companies have any clout here, huh? Nobody saw nothing. Well, nobody saw nothing. Oh, so <laughs> accidents aren't actually what's wanted. Okay. Nobody saw nothing. Well, nobody saw nothing. Love it. That was a bit of an abrupt cut, but that's how it is. Okay, so it's about a, an old an old school scarer type in Recruit learning to be funny through the maintenance team and their accidents, which are probably going to be the source of the funny. Or he's not allowed to be a scarer, so they're putting him on the maintenance team. Is that it? You're no longer hiring scarers? <laughs> scarers are out. Jokesters are in. Report to Mift. What exactly? Report to the maintenance team. Okay. I don't know. <laughs> The previous models look more like actual monsters, but these look like dumbed down uh, monsters. I see. Yeah, they look less scary. Is that what you're saying? It could also be because they're not trying to be scary anymore. So any of the scarers have been replaced, you know? Like, everyone here doesn't look scary because scary isn't needed. Funny is better. You know, they've replaced the whole system. Like, if you saw the, uh, there was, like, the epilogue of Monsters, Inc. I don't know why I remember. I guess it's because I watched it in December. You know, the final scene where the guys are going through to, um, obtain laughs. They're all wearing, like, clown outfits. They still the scary monsters, but they're wearing clown designs. And then, I guess, the next generation would be just a bunch of goofballs or something. Like, even him as a scarer, though, he does look a little bit soft, doesn't he? But, I mean, I'm, I'm perfectly fine with it. Like, I just... It looks new and fresh, and even though it's not as, like, 
gross looking because it's not 2003 technology. I'm gonna get behind it, you know. I'm a I'm a massive Pixar stan, and Monsters Inc. is like a kind of underrated gem. As much as it's not underrated at all, but like it's the one people I feel like it's the one people forget. Everyone thinks The Incredibles and Toy Story, you know, and Cars. Monsters Inc.'s grand, it's just like, for whatever reason, not to the top of everyone's thoughts. So are Sully and Mike gonna be the side characters? Yes, it looks like it. Um, the point is supposed to be that it's like this new guy coming in and working out the new company. That's one of the description I remember from the past. But apparently on the side, these guys are here. Is it the main voice actors? Uh, let me hear that again. Definitely Mike, and Sully just sounds more gruff, but probably, I mean, Monsters University was when? 2013? Something like that? So, I mean, plausible that it's them. But yeah, they are, I guess they're gonna be prevalent, which is nice, but they're the bosses probably doing their own things on the side. Which is interesting. I'm, I'm into it. 